with more rain on the way and all that snow on the ground, flooding is going to be a big concern. And that's a possibility on the minds of many in Lemonster. That's refiner NBC 10's Michael Rosenfield. Michael, this is a community that saw a lot of snow yesterday and also still dealing with the devastation of the flooding just a couple months ago. Yeah, a lot going on in Lemonster right now, and now we've got the snow and now the rain, and this could be a big problem for a lot of communities in Massachusetts. People are being urged to clear out their storm drains in their neighborhoods, storm drains like this one. And this one, you can see it's a problem. There are leaves on top of it. There is snow, and this can make it really difficult for all of the water to drain. Lemonster residents salting and snow blowing Monday night, still dealing with the aftermath of Sunday's storm. A lot of work. <laughs> Lemonster saw over 17 inches of snow. It's been a, a chore being old. I'm almost 70 years old, so it, it takes me a little bit of time. But now concern moves from the snow to the rain. With torrential downpours in the forecast, along with so much snow already on the ground, all that water could pose big problems. That's what I'm worried about because that back here kind of puddles up. Looks like a pond back here, but, you know, it is what it is. Communities are asking people to pitch in and clear out storm drains. How important is it to do what you did to clear the storm drain on your street? It is important because, you know, what it is is that, but, you know, a lot of the older people can't do that. And I just happen to have a good machine. In Lemonster, there's thousands of these catch basins across the city. DPW crews spent much of the day reaching as many as possible. We're surrounded by 12 hills. And I could just tell you where all that water goes from those 12 hills. It comes down. There are many flood-prone areas in Lemonster, a city still recovering from the September deluge that flooded basements, cars, and properties, and now this. We're a little bit concerned. Um, we were, we've got sandbags. We gave out two pallets of sandbags today. So as you heard Pete talk about, there's also a lot of wind in the forecast. This could lead to serious power outages with trees coming down, power lines coming down. Eversource said today it is bringing in extra crews to deal with any potential problems that pop up. We're live in Lemonster tonight. Michael Rosenfield, NBC10 Boston.